Get you some ass. Get you a little snippet. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Welcome to Lulu's Barbecue. Home of the number one barbecue destination location in southeast Missouri. That's, that's nasty. Lit. That's some nasty crap right there. In southeast Missouri. We're claimed to cook the best barbecue from Memphis to St. Louis to Kansas City. We can't be beat. Gary Run T. My name is Cody, and this is Colby. We are the owners of Lulu Soul Smoking uh, Barbecue. Uh, we are twins. As you can tell, he has gained a little bit of weight. And he says it's muscle. I grew up me a Richard Rawlings beer, if you can see right there. You know, gas monkey garage. Yeah, getting that out. Wanna be. Well, I'm a wanna be. Wanna be. Richard Rawlings wanna be. <laughs> anyway. Uh, to be a true pit master, you need to be able to make your own seasoning. If you're buying it from the store, you're not a true pit master. You need to be able to make your own seasoning. We actually make this in-house. People love it. If you're using commercial products, then you're not a real pit master. You need to learn how to do things on the low scale. We started out in 2010 with our business, one grill, not knowing anything about barbecue. We just kind of learned and on the Learn and Earn program of what Hank Baden told me. Learn and Earn. Learn and Earn It's program. like welfare, but we earned it. That's right, we earned it. So you need to learn how to make your own seasoning and your own sauce. We have won a lot of awards, but you can see right here with my son is pretty much right there. It's about 20 degrees outside. It has been raining. It has been sleeting. It has been snowing. But we're still going to shoot Pitmaster right. video. What you got this crap for? I don't know why I got the crap for this is what everybody else does. The big right? blue bottle. The honey. Yeah, I know. But we cook six days a week off the location of the Big Red Slate. You can't beat the Big Red Slate. <laughs> Son, I'm talking the honey is frozen. It is 20 degrees out here, though. It is 20 degrees. If you use this crap, anybody can use this. Anybody can use that honey to win barbecue competition. It takes a true pit master not to use the big blue bottle or the honey, which everybody uses in barbecue. It's junk. Put my knife back up. Put your knife back up. Over here, we have the Nolan's Custom Smoker. It's an insulated charcoal burner. Go ahead and tell them about it. Ooh, ah. This is a two inch insulated smoker. Made by Nolan Custom Cookers in Saxon, Missouri. It is a three shell. Built exactly for us. And what's her name? It's the Sinister. The Sinister. Why? Because she's bad. She got three trays, slide in and out. A little bit more heavy duty than everybody else's. A few different things. Got a dual wall chamber flow. We so bad we didn't even need a guru. Insulated walls. We ain't got a temperature gauge, don't even use a guru. We don't even need that crap. Anyway, it's a real nice smoker. But he makes a current perfect package. You check him out at uh what is it? Bluesbarbecue.com on our website. Check out Nolan Custom Cookers there. He makes a bunch of different th stuff. Good prices, good quality. Uh, lasts a lifetime, stuff like that. Does a lot of different things. Now, if you've been watching this, you you got to know who Lulu's is. Because I am the host of the number one barbecue show in America. The Lulu's Soul Smoking Radio Show. It's on Blog Talk Radio. If you don't know who we are, then where have you been? We're on Twitter. We're on Facebook. We're on LinkedIn. We're on Pinterest. Everybody knows who Lulu's Barbecue is. Yep. And I'm going to tell you why they know who we are from Memphis to St. Louis right now. Hey, I know why they know who we are. Why they know who we are. Because we're the first person to ever do the radio show from Jack Daniels World. Final. That's right. Jack Daniels Live. The biggest show ever done. Greg Rippey? Who's Greg Rippey? I don't know who Greg Rippey is. But anyway, let me show you what made us what made us famous. Barbecue Would you see the Lulu's Famous Barbecue back here? Let me give you a little hint right here. Oh, it's this rack. Come check out these ribs right here. What else you got in here? You got some more ribs? I got some ribs. I got more ribs in here. Juicy. Tender. Let me tell you something about these ribs. You saw the blue bottle. You saw the honey. I don't use honey. And I don't use the blue bottle. And the other thing about these ribs. We don't use sauce. These are straight perfection. You should be able to put love in your product. To make a great product for your customers. So they know what great food is. You put sauce on them? No, nope, no sauce. Oh, let me that pack. Oh, you're gonna drink a little bit. That's some good stuff. This is great ribs. See the smoke ring in it? Just come right apart. Look at the juice in them. Look at that juice up in them. Right, Steaming up that. the camera. You wanna buy that? Yeah, I'm hungry. I ain't eating mm. nothing all day. I ain't eating nothing all day either. Mm. 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 You're gonna fish and grill. But they all good at eating them. These are good eating them. I thought I didn't have food gathering. Oh. Food gathering! What was her name? <laughs> what was her name? Porky. Porky. <laughs> Miss Penny. Mm -hmm. 
Now, if you like ribs, see that white discoloration on it, real? That's a good rib. Maybe you like a little chicken. Pour a little chicken here. Can we do the hot? Nice. Bark on these chicken. Pull that chicken leg right off. Now, Randy Hill, Southern Crump Boys. There you go, Randy. There's your chicken leg. Look how you cut some chicken. Let me cut the thigh off right there. And you got you some thigh. You got you some wing. And you got some breast meat. That's how you cut a chicken, Southern Crump Boys, right there. Y'all too busy making uh, Bloody Mary libations to drink barbecue libations. This is how you cook right here. Right here, Randy. Look. Oh. Nothing goes better with barbecue other than moonshine. Then, country style beans right here. Mmm. Country burnt beans. Turn them things up. Mmm. Mash them grass. They are western skillet beans. Back in our cowboy days. What do you say about beans? Make you want to fart. <laughs> Randy. Ha <laughs> ha. Mm. Woo. It's a little hot. They are a little hot. Good skillet beans, though. Let me tell you them. this. If you want some of the best pit masters in America, you're looking at them right now. I guarantee you. So go ahead and give us that call, John Marcus, and I'll make it all worth your John while. John Marcus, wasn't he on the radio show? He was on the radio show, John Marcus was. Mm. Appreciate him having on. Check more out at www.lulusbarbecue.com and see what the customers have to say. Give us a phone call. We'll be waiting.